hi guys you're welcome back to my channel my name is stella i want to especially appreciate everyone that is already part of this family i appreciate you guys so much and if you're just seeing my video for the first time kindly subscribe and join the family because i post in tutorials and you're going to love it here all right so in today's video we're going to learn how to draft cut and sew a basic puff sleeve so let's jump right into the video now the only thing you need is your basic short sleeve pattern and here is my basic short sleeve pattern okay so the sleeve length is seven inches right and the round sleeve is simply your own round sleeve now the first thing we're going to do is to go ahead and mark the midpoint of this sleeve and here it is now we need to mark our slash lines and from the center line i'll go ahead and mark two inches on each side so I'll mark two inches on the left and two inches on the right. I'll also go ahead and mark it on the lower part of the sleeve just so that we can get a straight line. Now I'll proceed to connect this using my ruler. Here we have it. So I'll go ahead and cut this, but we are not cutting through. All right. So there's a difference between cutting it through and not cutting through. Okay. So here it is, I have slashed this. Now I'll come in with another pattern paper and we'll spread it. This is it. I've gone ahead to spread it on a new pattern paper. And I also went ahead to spread using 1.25 inches. So what this simply means is that the space in between each of them is 1.25 inches. Now I'll proceed to blend the top part all right so that we can have an even curve and we we'll also need to blend the lower part as well but we'll be doing this using our french curve so i will go ahead and just use a slight curve to connect the lower part i'll go ahead and connect this and we will proceed Here we have it i have connected it now we'll proceed to cut this out yeah our pattern is ready now we will need to mark where our slash started all right because that's exactly where we will be gathering from okay so we're going to be gathering in between this space now i'll proceed to transfer this to the fabric and here we have it i have also added my sewing allowance and my side seam allowance now i'll go ahead and iron down my interfacing on this i'll iron it on just the fashion fabric alone and we're going to be notching where we started slashing the pattern from all right so on the on the fabric i'm going to be notching this as well and here we have it i have ironed down my interfacing on just the fashion fabric alone and i went ahead to join the lower part using 0.5 inch now we'll proceed to to join and to join we're going to open up the sleeve and fold it into two and i'll go ahead and use one inch to join it on the side afterwards i'll open it up this way then i will run two gather stitches the gather stitches that we talked about all right and here it is I've gone ahead to, to join the sleeve. I also gathered the top part. All right, you remember our notches? I have it on the fashion fabric. Now I'll go ahead and attach the sleeve to my peplum blouse this way. Okay, now you need to ensure that the middle of the sleeve is on the shoulder joining. So I'll go ahead and join this. And here we have it, I'm done. It's actually a quick, sleeve all right and i love the finished look thank you guys for watching kindly subscribe to my channel and turn on your notification bell because i upload sewing tutorials on this channel and they are super detailed you are also free to ask me questions if there is any area that you did not understand all right i also have a detailed video on the drafting cutting and sewing of this lovely peplum top and the pencil skirt I'll leave the link in the description box. Thank you guys. Till we meet again in my next one. Bye.